Oh, hella bid, it's your boy Big Bid B, and we back for another edition of Big Bid Business. As a fragrance reviewer slash connoisseur, I often get questions from a lot of you guys out there like, Big Bid B, I need to smell good for the ladies, and how do I do it? Well, today, fellas, I'm here to give you five fragrances that will make the ladies melt. <laughs> Now, personally, when I think of fragrances that make women excited, I think about fragrances that are dark, fragrances that are seductive, but there are also fragrances that are fresh and clean, like Outkast. You did. So without any further ado, let's get to this list. Now the first fragrance I will be mentioning today is a usual suspect when it comes to videos like this, well at least for me. This one is great for the fall or winter and great for a fragrance to wear if you want to cuddle with your boo thing. And this one is Mesa Margiela's By The Fire Place. Now this one is a unisex fragrance that is one of the reasons that women will enjoy this thing on you. This one is roasted chestnuts it's vanilla it's smoke and it is amazing i really do enjoy this fragrance i personally gave this one a 10 out of 10 when rocking this thing because it's that good now different strokes for different folks so not everyone will like this fragrance or love it or want some more of it but your boy is here for it all right this is a solid fragrance one that i recommend every fall every winter and if you're looking for something for a cuddle buddy then look no further now the next fragrance on today's list is also <laughs> no stranger to the channel. This one comes from Paco Rabanne, and if you're looking to get lucky, then you need one million lucky. Now fellas, one million lucky is not going to guarantee that you get lucky, but it will definitely help you imbibe the way of smelling great, right? I think that's a, something that a lot of guys forget about, is smelling amazing when you're looking to introduce yourself to that special someone, and one million lucky is, is it, man. Um, this one has some different notes in it, and I really like it. I think you have like green plum in this thing here, and it's just hazelnut. Listen, man, look at how much juice is gone from this thing. So when I talk about using this fragrance, I really, really use it. When I did the weekly fragrance rotation videos, you can see how much I use this fragrance and the compliment factor that went along with this. Now, weekly fragrance rotation videos will be coming back eventually. But if you're looking to, to kind of figure that out, man, go back, look at some weekly fragrance rotation videos, and you will see everything you need to know about this fragrance. I also did like a first impression slash unboxing on this fragrance. Look for it. It'll give you all the details on this one because this thing is amazing. Now the next fragrance on my list today is actually one that came out in late 2018. It's listed as Oriental Fougere fragrance. To me, this one is a unisex fragrance, but this one leans more to the clean side. I was a huge fan of this fragrance when it originally came out and I wanted it in my collection and it's here. This one comes from Bar Number no. 9 and this is Bar Number no. 9's Lafayette Street. This one is clean, it's slightly gourmand and it smells well. It smells to die for. <laughs> now in this fragrance, you have some bergamot, you have some ambergris, you have some woody notes in this one, and some tonka bean for extra sweetness. Now, Bond generally gets some flack for uh, being synthetic. And this one isn't like overly natural, but it isn't overly synthetic either. But I haven't really smelled anything that smells close to this one um to me this one is fresh it's clean it's inviting and one that i think the ladies will really really enjoy to me i think you're going to get tons of compliments on this one and you can actually pick this one up for a discounted price now um i originally introduced this fragrance as i was talking about it um i did a meet and greet down in Saks, but I actually picked this one up from maxaroma.com. Not familiar with Max Aroma, they are like a fragrance discounter. They have a ton of fragrances on their site that you can shop through. And they also do these influencer bundles where we go in there, we select out picks for the month, and you guys can go in there and try them out. Um, this one is one that comes up quite a bit, at least I, I think. Now we got this little form that we go in and fill out and I see like, uh, you know, this one come up a few times and they often sell out of this fragrance because it's that good. So when it can make it influence a bundle, then make sure you try it out. If not, go to their site, check it out, man, because Lafayette Street from Bar Number 9 is dopeness.com. Um, all right, listen, man, tell them your boy sent you. I don't have a discount code enough, but just go to their site, check it out because 
Um, they have a ton of savings deals and deals available on their site. Somebody recently hit me up and said, Big BB, why wouldn't anybody shop at a regular place when you have sites like this available? And I said, you know, some people like to do what they do. But if you're looking to make your money stretch further in 2020, check out Max Aroma. Bar number nine, Lafayette Street is there. <laughs> well, was there. <laughs> if you're a lucky person, you might have got it. If not, it's gone. Buy something else. Now, the next fragrance on my list today of five fragrances that will make women melt is also listed as a unisex fragrance, but I think this one lands a bit more on the masculine side of the fence, and this one has some darkness, you have some patchouli, you have some spices, you have sugar, spice, and everything nice. I, I guess that would be a woman. But, nonetheless, this is why it will make a woman melt, but this one is Tuxedo from the good people at YSL. Now, this one is in the exclusive line, okay? So, you will not find this one like in your Macy's or anything like that, but you can find this at the people at Max Roma if you were looking. This one is super dope. Um, one that a lot of us fragrance reviewers talk about for fall and winter and just any type of, you know, cuddle buddy type of sense i enjoy this fragrance i think you'll like it as well this one is a bit different um especially when you're looking at ysl fragrances in themselves right this one does last longer it's a bit more adult like if you look at fragrances that they release like loam or um why this one is way 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 different all right um, i think you'll like this one as well as a lot of the others from their uh, exclusive lineup but i think this one is a stand out fragrance if you can't get your nose on it do so tuxedo from ysl and yes this will pair well with your ysl tuxedo and the final fragrance on today's list of five fragrances that will make women melt comes from Armani. And this one is Armani Code Pro Fumo. Now, this one is traditionally more or less a winter based fragrance, but it's definitely there for your cuddle buddies, all right? So, listen, man, this one has leather, you have tonka bean, you have amber, and this one is a nice cozy all around fragrance this one does have good performance on it as well you can spray this thing on and be good to go i have not done a full review on this fragrance even though i have like i have this on a list of full reviews to do like i started to to get it together i just never actually recorded it maybe i will bring that to you guys in 2020 but i think this one is really really dope i actually put a fragrance up a picture up and i said hey left or right and it was between armani code and parfum vintage Gold Dolphin, and a lot of you guys and girls out there chose Armani Code Profumo over the legendary Gold Dolphin. So that just speaks to how good this fragrance actually is. So if you're looking for a fragrance that's going to make her melt when you spray it on, then, you know, this is what you get. There you go, man. I have five fragrances for you that will make the ladies melt. If you have any additional fragrances that you feel missing from the list, go ahead and comment them down below. As always, I'm your boy. Big BB, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend that we are back again on the road to 100K. Hit my people at Max Aroma down below. I'll have them linked. If I can get a discount code, I will. So you can try any of these fragrances at a discount. And while you at it, hit the goddamn bell.